Probably shouldn't have. So much stuff. Do no, it. it says so much stuff goes through my mind. Right there. Yeah, you could have told. Why are you on these challenges? I'm really very pissed. <laughs> Hey, Lucius. Where are we going? To the Pink Palace. And what are we gonna see at the Pink Palace? The Wicked Plant. Cool. It's a it's a, a new, new exhibit. exhibit. Yeah. What they do you think? They took out the Grossology and put in the, in the Wicked Plant. Yeah, but that's cool. It showed huh? it up on a magazine. Yeah. You what? I'm gonna be able to drive in eight months. <laughs> You're excited. <laughs> you put those in your pocket, buddy. So we don't lose them? What is that, Casimir? Blue ants are actually black ants. Blue oh, ants are, are the one? black ants? That's velvet ants. Let's see what it is. What does it say? Insects more. Arachnids. These creatures have bristly hairs and bright s splashes of color to scare off predators. Uh, what does that one say? It says reptiles. Warning signals are. Rare in reptiles, amphibians, and especially fish, but some snakes do express bold colors, patterns, and sounds. These bold color patterns are often mimicked by their... Turn it. I want this job, where I get to walk around or go to different places and set up cool stuff like this. Like, look, it's painted. And this is made. Yeah. I like this one. <laughs> I know. It's really awesome. Anybody out there know a job where I can go around and do cool stuff like this? Tell me. That's one big old dude. His name is High Fructose Corn Syrup. <laughs> That's like the body type of most the majority of uh American. the american population <laughs> now you can say congratulations to whoever's getting married that is so pretty <laughs> She has a good little nap. Yeah.
All right, now where y'all want to go? Back to the park. The, the lizards and the reptiles and stuff is air conditioned. It won't be hot. Okay. All right. Alligator. Yeah. Is that a live alligator? Yes, it is a live alligator. That's right. It's perfectly still, and then it's gonna move. When, yeah. That's the mama alligator. That's the baby alligator. Hmm. So that has that baby. Yes, they're alive. That's his lady. The lizard's tail breaks off when it's scared, right? So this lizard and that lizard both had their tails broke off. You want to know why? Because it probably came off when they were, when they were captured to get them in the so They tried to catch them by the tail and their tails broke off. Tail, they, their tails break off when they try to catch them? Yep. Pretty cool. That guy has a question on him. He does. I think, it, I think it's a number three. Yeah. This one has a two on it. It's, a, it's called a dwarf, a West African dwarf crocodile. Now, what do you think? What do you think? What? Since it's small, what do you think having really big eyes and a really big nose would help when you're really little? It's cute. Well, it's cute. so you can see better, so you can get back. See better? And smell when, when a predator is coming. Ah, do you think the eyes would help you uh, see fi find your food pretty good? Yeah. You think, what do you think a nose would be good for finding food too? Trying to get around, huh? Yeah. Well, I know. I see all the. Oh no! Look at its mouth. Ah, this guy right here is pretty cool. <laughs> yeah. Wow, it's got that's a, a chameleon. Cuban false chameleon. It tries to blend in. Oh, it's blending in with rocks. Uh, uh, don't tap the glass. Why not? Because it makes them nervous. We had a sweet production meeting and we got lots of things done, especially a schedule. And a, one location. You want to do what? Oh, y'all want to watch one more episode? How many episodes have you watched? You've watched two? Yeah. One more, then that's it, okay? What you got? <laughs> Joanna! What kind of manly things are you making? I'm making some uh, chicken livers. <laughs> I said I said manly so so that whatever you're making is manly even though you have a girly apron on. <laughs> <laughs> they smell delicious. Yes, they do. And my body says I want those. <laughs> feed me, Seymour, feed me. 
every time somebody talks about being hungry, I'm going to say that. I really liked that movie when I was a kid, and I, I haven't seen it in a long time. I liked it, too. I think we tried to rewatch it one time, and I thought, man, this is a pretty gruesome movie for us to have watched it when we were children. Like, with me and you tried to watch it? Um, no, me and Madison tried to watch it, I think. And I was thinking, this is, um, a pretty horrible movie for kids to be watching. The dude's, like, kidnapping people and chopping them up and feeding them to a plant. And it like shows them like hacking, you know, and then there's like blood splatter and stuff in the shadows. <laughs> she dumped it over and it rolled out. <laughs> <laughs> Did it come out? You hiding it? Whoop! It just isn't working out for you. Where's your purse? What'd you do with your purse? Came up on it. Let's try this again. That's what's the problem. That car's in the way. <laughs> oh, no, no. Don't go over my daddy. He's frying. Hot. Just like dropped it behind his shoulder. Oh, thank you. Hey, that was, you don't need to throw that. Sweaty. Yeah. I did it. <laughs> you gotta get all the way up to the top and touch, touch the top. Oh, you're like I touched it. <laughs> I think what it is is you're not strong enough to hold yourself that long. <laughs> Oh, would you put um in here the Valentina? Yeah.